Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we are opening up some Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom blind bags. So, okay, I only have three because I'm just a poor boy and nobody loves me. So I got these three um, in the US and I think they were going for like, I don't know, like 350 or 450. I don't know, I really totally don't remember. But then I came back to Canada and I'm like, oh, they have them here now. When I left, the Walmart didn't have any Fallen Kingdom stuff, except for a couple of pieces of Lego. But then when I came back, they finally had some Fallen Kingdom stuff, including some of these blind bags. And then I went to go price check it, and it was like $6.97 for this tiny little piece of plastic. I have never really done blind bags before. I am not a huge fan of blind bags. The only reason, because they're so gosh damn darn expensive. Look on the side here, we can see all the little things that we could possibly get, all the little figures. So we have here the Tyrannosaurus Rex, we have an Apatosaurus, Dilophosaurus, Triceratops, Stegosaurus, Ankylosaurus, Velociraptor, Velociraptor Blue, Parasaurolophus, Lil Stiggy, a Pteranodon, and the Baryonyx. So if we look on the front here, we see we have Claw coming out of an egg. Um, I, it kind of looks like, you know, the Indominus Rex, you know, kind of pose, you know, when he was coming out of the egg. Obviously, we don't see the eye or anything. So maybe this is supposed to be, I don't know, the Indoraptor or something. But we do have, you know, an egg. Oh, the Indoraptor is not even actually on here. This is probably just a generic dinosaur. Just like, oh, what dinosaur are you going to get? And we have here the beautiful kind of Fallen Kingdom background that we see on a lot of the merchandise here. We have that nice big exploding volcano, which is pretty awesome. So let's go ahead and open the blind bag. So I have kind of felt these and unfortunately I feel something super super flat and that is totally a pteranodon. So already right off the bat I'm like god damn it I got a pteranodon. That's like one of the ones I didn't want. So I'm gonna go ahead and open this one because I know it's a pteranodon. God damn it. Wow this is really hard to open. Oh there we go. Yeah great great. Yeah, we got the Pteranodon. Thanks a lot. I really didn't want this one because it's so small. So if you see here, uh, this Pteranodon, we actually have a Jurassic Park kind of symbol under here. We have the T-Rex here and it's kind of cool. These wings do fold like up and down, which I guess is the saving grace of this piece because uh, it's, you know, a flat little piece of plastic. It's not really that cool. But whatever, I'm just gonna, you know, put it on my shelf and let it fly around. Cool, a little checklist of all the ones we're not gonna get. Oh, you can get an Indominus Rex. You can get like a ghost Indominus Rex. That's so cool. Wow, only available in three packs. Oh yeah, I've seen the Indominus Rex in those three packs. Yeah, I love you, Dress Park, but I don't love it when you're gouging me with these prices. And I got the freaking Pteranodon that I didn't want. Okay. So let's open up the next one. Okay, well, is this another Pteranodon or like a different color one? It's pretty easy to open. Ugh. Oh, Dilophosaurus! Oh, yes! Okay, I really wanted that one. Oh, there's like a little protected piece of plastic. Oh, that is so cute. Look at this little Dilophosaurus. Oh my God, that's so adorable. Oh, and its head goes up and down too. Yeah, it's got a little ball joint, just like the wings on the Pteranodon. I really like this. I really wanted the Dilophosaurus. Oh, look at that little paint job too. But again, you're not with seven dollars, man. Okay, and the last one. Please let it be Tyrannosaurus Rex. If this is a Tyrannosaurus Rex, I will poop my pants. Oh my god. You know how there's 12 different dinosaurs you can possibly get? Guess who got a freaking double? So I got two Dilophosauruses now. So Okay, so not only did I get the Pteranodon that I really didn't want because it's flat as a pancake and it's basically not even existent, but I got two of the same one. It's not even like they're painted differently. Like they're, it's not like you can get like a whole bunch of different types of, it's just the same one. Oh, I'm so disappointed. This has been the worst blind bag experience of my life. This is the first blind bag experience and my last blind bag experience because I didn't have a good experience with blind bags. So I definitely won't be doing any more of these blind bags anymore. I'm trying to figure out what to do with them. Maybe I was thinking about making like some cool kind of like wine glasses and then maybe just like gluing them on or something and dressing it up a little bit. I don't know, but I really need to get my money out of these because these are a waste of money. Am I the only one that thinks blind bags are a scam? If you look at the, um, 
actual figure itself. And then if you look at the figure that is posted on here, it is quite different. I mean, the figure on here looks so detailed. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and please let me know if you guys enjoy blind bags. Have you guys opened any of the Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom blind bags? Tell me, tell me if you have gotten the Apatosaurus because that one seriously looks the sweetest to me. And also the Stegosaurus and the Triceratops. So please remember to like, comment, and subscribe. I come with new videos every Wednesday and Saturday, unless if I can buy it for Chinese food. So thank you guys so much for watching and stay legendary. Yeah.